known as the Mini League of Nations with two Irishmen, Jerry Connor and Jordi Jordan, a Frenchman, Francois Hardy, a Greek, Peter Papanatio. Four years ago, the group formed while the members were touring this country with other groups from overseas. This smooth four-piece outfit proved to be a consistent crowd puller at the World Tavern in earlier days. Hi, I'm Jerry, lead vocalist. Hi, I'm Jordi, and I'm the keyboardist and songwriter. I'm Peter, the bass player. Hi, je m'appelle François and I'm the drummer. Their versatile brand of music ensured that Equinox became Durban's number one pop group. We've been very successful in Durban over the last couple of years. Uh, we've had some enjoyable experiences here. People seem to respond to the type of music we played and uh, the feeling was mutual. We have a great love for the people of Durban. People in Durban are magic. Um, we're now becoming national, internet, well, internationally known. So before, uh, they treated us like stars. We had our own venue and they came every single night. The place was full every single night we played there. And when we did the, uh, the orchestral thing with NAPAC, that was the cherry on the top. That's when all the people filled the hall in Durban. And even people were turned away. Lots of people were turned away, standing ovations. It was indeed an OMD for Equinox, an orchestral maneuver in Durban. The fusion of the Natal Philharmonic Orchestra and a pop group giving a brilliant performance of classic rock, a first for a local band. Their music has, however, undergone dramatic changes since their earlier numbers. Music certainly has changed, like for example, a couple of years ago, uh, songs like Magic Night, City Streets, uh, The Lucky One, uh, they weren't as commercial as the songs we're playing right now. We feel that we've got the right uh, ingredients to make hit songs, and that's basically what this business is all about, is making hit songs. We don't have a particular brand of music, if you know what I mean, like reggae and stuff like that, because I don't think it actually suits the band's image. So basically what I tend to do is to um, uh, if I'm starting a song, uh, I've got the four guys in mind, the personalities, the vocal range of Jerry, say, and I work from there. A nice, strong melody line and a beat, a danceable beat. Their recent popular single, Kiss Kiss Goodbye, reached number three on the Loud and Proud Top 20. With a fond farewell to their fans in Durban, Equinox moved to the Golden City and signed a recording contract for their debut album. And what of their image? We all have a, a very sort of natural, healthy outlook to life, and it does uh, uh, reflect us on stage and uh, in our music as well. You know, we're not uh, extravagant or we don't go overboard. I think it's time that a clean image band came forward. So that's what we're trying to do, I think. And now here on the Loud and Proud slot on NJR, we've managed to bend the budget just a little bit to bring you at enormous expense, direct from via Durban, Val River, Equinox. Welcome to the studio, guys. What's Hi. happening? Well, we're currently playing at the Riviera Sun International on the Vol River. And the response has been fantastic. Thank you, Transport. Our album will be out at the end of March, and it's called Forever Together. And here's our latest music video, Love in the Fast Lane. <laughs> 